Well, 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 my fragrance friends, summer is upon us and that means that it's time to bring out those big guns and also conquer the fragrance game like never before. Today, my gems, I'm here to give you 10 strong, amazing summer fragrances that will make heads turn, they will make hearts skip a beat and they will leave a lasting impression that even your ex will envy. Now, before we start, I just want to establish one thing. We are not here to talk about those subtle, faint-hearted fragrances that will disappear even faster than your ex's promises. Oh no, we are going strong. We are talking about the strong fragrances like a Greek god in the gym, flexing his muscles, making even Zeus quiver. So I have created a list of 10 amazing beast mode strong summer scents for men that's all fit for the title of an alpha scent. These are the powerhouses, they are the heavy hitters that demands attention. But don't be fooled, gentlemen. These scents are not for the timid souls who really is comfortable blending into the crowd. These are for the bold for the confident and for the man who dares to stand out. So grab your notepads, take a seat and be ready to be schooled in the art of summer scent seduction. Here's to a summer with scents that will make women weak in the knees and make other men green of envy. So let's go. And the first one up is YSLY and this is the EDT Intense. This is the latest one in the Y collection. And this one is not far from the rest and it's definitely not far from the EDP but this is somehow deeper and it's richer and it has something a bit more green and herbal about it. A perfect aromatic fragrance to smell very mass appealing and this is extremely easy to use. I mean there is no situation where you cannot spray this on and expect to smell perfect for the occasion. So if you have YEDP the original do you need this one? I would say maybe you do not need to have both but if you're buying your first Y fragrance this is definitely a good alternative and if you are maybe running out on your EDP bottle when you are going to get a new one get this one and you will get an up upgraded scent. I'm not going to sit and say for every scent in this video that this is a beast mode performer. We have already established that. These are strong summer fragrances for men that will stay on your skin for long and they will project. The next one is Puck Rabanne Invictus Legend. Now this one has been on the market for quite some time. I think they released it in 2019 and or 2020. I'm going to let that be unsaid. But this has been around for years and it's because it's a really good one. And it has one thing that I really appreciate in fragrances that just turns up the heat and that is sea salt. So this one is, it's marine, it's aromatic. There is something slightly green about it and that, that sea salt just makes it magic. This is wonderfully fresh, it's also a bit spicy and it's just the perfect kind of summer scent that you spray on when you are going out for summer activities. No matter if that's a date or you are just going to do some sport with friends or just going hanging out, doing something nice outside when the sun is shining, this is an amazing one. And if you do like the other Evictus fragrances, this is a no-brainer. You will like this too. And moving on to a brand that I am really impressed by. They have so many good fragrances and many of them are cheapies, which is always a good thing. I don't care about niche. I don't care about prices, cheapies, whatever. Or I do care about cheapies. I think the only thing that is important with a fragrance is how it smells. No matter if it's a cheapy or niche. I mean, niche fragrances are, there are many amazing ones, but there are also many that doesn't smell good at all. But a good cheapy that you can afford, no matter what your budget is, is always a good thing. And the one I have picked out for this video is Dunhill Century Blue. Dunhill creates incredible fragrances, often quite cheap. And what I love about this one is that it's fresh, it's spicy, it's somehow warm and it's also a bit powdery. This is not a heavy powdery fragrance. It's just there somewhere just lingering around in the most perfect way. There's different spicy notes. There's some iris for that powderiness. And you know what? This also has sea salt. So if you are looking for a kind of fragrance that is very easy to wear, very masculine, but yet soft, 
this is a perfect one and especially if your budget is not that big. And the next one is a fragrance that didn't impress me extremely much when I first smelled it on a test strip when I bought it. But when I got to smell this on skin, it was a whole other story. And this is the Gucci Guilty Parfum for all. This is so nice with notes that are woody, aromatic, citrusy, fresh and what makes it stand out and what makes it not just an ordinary aromatic fresh fragrance is that it also has these floral notes that just brings it over the top to being extremely good. And when you mix citrus notes, aromatic notes and some florals and with a musky base, you create something that is very masculine very inviting and very sophisticated. And the next one is from the House of Seduction and it is Jean-Paul Gaultier Le Mal in the Navy. There is never ever a bad day to wear a Jean-Paul Gaultier fragrance and all of the Jean-Paul Gaultier fragrances just performs like crazy in the summer and in the warm weather. I have said this before but a Jean-Paul Gaultier fragrance on warm skin with the sun shining is just one of the most sexy thing a woman can smell. And I have said this before, a Jean-Paul Gaultier fragrance on a warm body, on warm skin when the heat is up and the sun is shining is just something incredibly seductive. This one is marine. It's aromatic, it's aquatic and it also has this beautiful vanilla note that you find in almost all of the Jean-Paul Gaultier fragrances. And that vanilla is seductive. This also has a beautiful fresh mint note and in the base there is ambergris which also brings some warmth and some saltiness to it. And I don't think I have to say one more time that I enjoy salty notes in fragrances so I'm not gonna say it again. And the next one is a fragrance that I'm almost hell hostage with. Well if I wouldn't include this one in a list about strong summer fragrances for men there would be several men saying how could you not include this one? So I felt that I just had to include it although the comments would be nice because comments helps with the reach you know but I'm gonna do it anyway. So the one is how was for him from Rassasi. And I have talked about this so many times that I almost don't even have to sniff it to know how it smells. This is an aquatic and fresh fragrance with a fruity top. It's a beast mode performer and this has a beautiful mix of spicy notes like cinnamon and cardamom. There is apple and there is fruity plum and you know how I feel about plum in fragrances. I think I like it as much as I like salty notes in fragrances. So I'm guessing the perfect scent would be something that has both plum and salt in it. But I haven't found one yet. If you know a fragrance that has both plum and salt, please hit me up in the comments. That sounded dirty in some way, but I just meant comment. How was for him is a beast mode performer and it is a compliment puller. And the next one seems to be quite polarizing. There seems to be people like me who absolutely love it and there's also guys who absolutely wouldn't wear it. But if you wanna smell good, if you like beast mode performers and if you wanna make those women's hearts skip a beat, I think you should wear Sadly from Parfums de Marly. I absolutely love this one. It's aromatic, it's fresh, it's citrusy but it's also musky and to my nose soapy and I don't like soapy fragrances but I love this one. So the top notes here are a beautiful mix of citrusy notes together with mint. Then there's an aromatic mix with lavender, geranium and in the base you have that musky and broxan and a beautiful sandalwood note. Do not underestimate the power in this perfect niche fragrance that just makes any man smell incredibly masculine but also very inviting and seductive. This is sophisticated, it's elegant but it's also extremely seductive. And the next one is a fragrance that came to my attention thanks to you guys because you were so many commenting on my videos that I really should try this one and the one is Missoni Wave. Missoni Wave is the perfect aquatic freshie with a salty note. And that salty note comes from the sea notes in the top. And then there is an aromatic mix and vanilla orchid. And this is one that when you spray this on, the scent cloud is so amazing. And when you move around wearing this and the whips that people are getting around you, 
will surely bring in compliments because this is the kind of scent that you just can't smell it without reacting to it. So if you need something that is extremely easy to wear, an easy reach for the summer, Missoni Wave is one you have to try. This is not a cheapy, but it's also not an expensive one. And some of you are going to get annoyed with me for bringing the next one up, but I think it's an amazing scent. It still works. It will always work because this is one of the most stylish fragrances a man can wear. And it's a sure scent that almost everyone likes to smell on a man. And I'm talking about the one and only Dior Sauvage, the original. And this one is funny because this is a scent that is so common that it's so easy to detect wherever you are. I was actually in London and in London there's a lot of people, there are different scents and it's not always that you pick up people's fragrances because there's so many impressions around you. But there was a guy getting out of a car quite far ahead from me, but he just sprayed some fragrance on and then just walked off. And when I got closer, I could smell immediately that it was Dior Sauvage. This is a beast mode performer and everyone will notice it when you have it on. And since everyone knows about this one, I don't think I have to go into the notes. But if you haven't tried it, this is something aromatic, fresh, spicy and musky. And it's one that you can't live a whole life without trying. And the last one up is from one of my favorite collections of fragrances and it's from the Prada Luna Rossa collection. And this is Prada Luna Rossa Carbon. This is not far from Prada Luna Rossa or Prada Luna Rossa Sport, but this is something a bit richer, slightly ashy or smoked and also a bit earthy. It has spicy fresh notes in the top with bergamot and black pepper and a mysterious mix in the midst with lavender, coal, soil tincture and watery notes. So imagine something smoky, ashy together with watery notes and you get something really cool like carbon. And there you have it, 10 amazing beast mode strong fragrances for the summer that will make you smell like a king. And remember, confidence is key, but a killer scent is the weapon that will make you unstoppable. Before we part, I wanna hear from you. Which is your go-to scent this summer? And have you tried any of the fragrances I mentioned in the video? So if you found this video helpful, don't forget to like the video and hit that subscribe button. And to my amazing subscribers, Thank you so much. You are the wind beneath my perfume loving wings. And I appreciate each and every one of you. Now go and embrace the summer with the perfect fragrance. Remember, you are not only wearing a fragrance, you are wearing a statement. Make it bold, make it unforgettable. So until next time, stay stylish, stay smart, and keep spreading those amazing smelling vibes around you. Bye.